Also from the Movie Mash group, special shout out to Shannon Nuxon, who shared the this post that is originally from Collider.com with 10 Disney animated princesses without live action adaptations. I'm sold, Rose. You get my complete and utter attention. You got my attention. Now I want to see these. Not all of them on the list. Just the ones that uh, just the ones that I picked that I will some of them I will play regular amount or some I will pay triple the amount with interest. Now let's begin on which Disney animated princess I want to see live action. Number one, in no particular order, Moana. We need much more, much, much more South Asian Pacific movies, themes and architectures. Come on, Disney, make this happen. You guys and gals got it. Take a chance. Take that risk. It'll work. I promise you on that. Now, these are the ones I'll pay triple the amount for. If number two, Brave, with a naturally Caucasian redheaded actress, don't bother if she isn't. For real, I really, really dislike, well, I hate and hate these race swappings. Seriously, this world is plentiful of diversity and different skin folks, like the oceans that harbor our frontiers and lands. Redhead actors and actresses aren't that hard to find, for real. Find them. Make this work. Live action brave with a Caucasian redheaded actress or don't even bother. Now, number three, I'll pay triple the amount for Princess and the Frog. Sadly, it didn't get no love because one, the lack of marketing and promoting, similar to the game like Kingdom's Amalar Reckoning, which is overshadowed by Skyrim. But Princess and the Frog, this is overshadowed by the by the CG animation and it buried the whole movie in the sands. It was very unique, very clever, very fresh, and it was all that rolled into one. And it was nice to have a black Disney princess for a change. This Shining Diamond needs a live action movie adaptation and fast. Another pay triple the amount for for Atlantis at number four. This would be dope AF and full on beast mode if they did this. Same fate with Princess and the Frog. It was just overshadowed, next to no marketing, which is very sad because this was before the CGI wave splash into the lexicon. And speaking of which, I'm going to add to this list at number five, Treasure Planet, which was still to this day, and sadly, that ship has sailed off into the void. Treasure Planet could have easily been a level in the Kingdom Hearts games. What a lost potential, missed opportunity, you name it. It is just it is sad and criminal that Treasure Planet never was in the Kingdom Hearts games. This also need a live adaptation. Now, these live action movies, just one suggestion, just one suggestion, Disney and anybody else, know what the race swap and keep them exactly how they are in their animated origins. Disney, you, always you, you has always been diversified. You always had multicultural backgrounds with your characters and so why fix that isn't broken just go back to keeping it simple because nowadays it's way way over complicated and that's why you have a division this now concludes the video and hope that you enjoyed and thank you for stopping by and please give this video like share this video comment down below and until next time Peace, love, and happiness. Happy watching.